come with me for a quick walk around tour on this 1982 38 Morgan here in Newport Beach. She's a fine blue water cruiser with great lines. Moving to the bow, we see our roller furling right here and our anchor. Coming down the port side, we can see how nice and shiny the deck is. It was repainted within the past few years, along with having the standing rigging replaced. Current owner is a captain, very proud of the maintenance on his vessel. Here at the cockpit, we have a nice view of the seating area, steering post, some sail wenches, We've got dual biminis here for comfort. At the transom we have a life sling and there's our radar post right there. Let's go aboard. Here we are stepping aboard blind date, nice and easy. It's fairly low to the dock and easy to get on board. Let's go forward, checking out some of the rigging. Notice the decking, nice non-skid, and in excellent condition. Here at the bow again, we've got our roller furling. Canvas is nice and soft, nice and supple. It's a canvas. Circling behind us, we have a view aft of the vessel. We also have a spinnaker pole here. Unfortunately, that's no longer with us. Here we are coming down starboard. This gives us an overhead view of the cockpit. Again, at the transom, we've got a boarding ladder, an optional outboard motor, and there's our life We have a nice stainless steel ship's wheel, leather covered for easy grip. Our gauges include a depth alarm, compass, and a knot lock. Moving forward, so we can easily keep an eye on our engine, we have our gauges right here. Oil pressure, tachometer, engine hours is showing 3228. Our temperature gauge, we also have a wind speed gauge and a rudder angle indicator. Here in the cockpit, we've got four winches, all Lumar, and then there on deck, another one up there. I have the sail cover off a little bit, and again, the sail is in nice, supple condition. Not new, but has a lot of life left. Checking out these lines, you can see they're fresh, supple, showing little signs of wear. Here, Let's go into the cab. Once inside the cabin, down a few stairs, we see our galley to port. This large counter space here.
offers a refrigerator freezer combination in there. We've got a gas stove, two burners with oven, gimbaled for use, lots of storage there, here, here. And right there. Also, we have a dual stainless steel sink. As the vessel was designed for blue water cruising, there's lots of storage all around. Coming down the port side, we see our L shaped sofa, which also converts into a sleeping area. I have the table partially up. This is a sailboat. Nice little feature, stowaway, yet easily, readily accessible. More storage along the gunnels. Interior wood is very fine, nice condition. The teak and holly floor is almost always covered. But check it out, she's in great condition. Got a head lined, separate seating area to take a shower, marine toilet, electrical outlets, and vanity. Forward, we have our master suite. Nice feature, privacy door, keeps the snoring down. And then large V berth, center line over seven feet, great area to sleep, gunnel storage also. And as this is the master suite, we even have some lower closet space there. Coming down along the starboard, We see we've got a, yet another hanging locker, sleeper sofa, we'll put a, another one of our buddies there. This up here is actually what's called a pilot's berth. So in rough weather, somebody can even lay up there. Moving aft, we have a nice little nav station. Here we have our power panel, VHF radio, let's get some of these nice Newport to Catalina badges in there, a Raytheon radar screen, probably wondering why we have it in here, to keep it nice and dry visible from the helm. Here we have our aft quarter berth. It's a good six and a half feet deep. And then we also have engine access here and then here up under the stairs. Battery access is nice and convenient right there. Let's get some more of these new part port Ensenada badges. Quite a bit of history here. Made the blind date has made the trip numerous times successfully. This vessel is well equipped, very well cared for, powered with a nice Perkins diesel engine, ready to go for as long as you want. Viewer today, owner tomorrow at South Mountain Yachts. Thank you.